Hello everyone! You can't see my face because the sun has just set. It is Jack the Spotter. I'm outside this theatre by the sea that you can't see. Still can't see. Here in Ramsgate because I just saw Bombay Bicycle Club. This is their first concert since uh, mooting their new album which doesn't come out until October which is a bit of a piss take but oh well. I came... You can't see it but I am wearing their merch. And Jack Stedman, the lead singer, he gave me a shout out for wearing this that you can't see, but I am honestly wearing. Probably the best thing that's ever happened to me at a concert. The lead singer noticed me. That's so crass to say, but you know, be honest, you know if it happened to you, you'll be bloody excited. Hello, it is me back again with another concert video. This time, it is another band who I've now seen more than twice, more than three times. This is my fourth time seeing Bombay Bicycle Club, who I can confidently say are my favourite band. I went and saw them in a really small venue in a town near enough London, I saw them in Ramsgate. It was their first show they had done in about a year and a half. First show revealing the new material for their upcoming sixth album and it being in a very small place in Ramsgate. I have been in this sort of setting before but it was in Northampton and I must say this venue in Ramsgate was a lot nicer than that place in Northampton. That was a real dive. Whereas this, uh, I got interviewed while I was there before the support act came on. There were these guys interviewing people in the front row about what they thought of the venue and if they'd been there before because they were making a documentary about it. And they said it was built in the 1940s. And I was hoping that around the front there was going to be some really elaborate architecture because I always thought it was the 50s where architecture just went down the toilet but it was just sort of a brick square. But oh well, venue aside, it, it was a really small venue and it's great to see such popular bands using these small spaces and keeping them alive. The place had just been under renovation and it was the first show in it since the renovations and they were still going on. There was a few hoardings up next to the front entrance. So as for the concert itself, because they haven't released the new album yet, it's coming out in October. It was just three or four songs off of all the previous albums, apart from Floors. Like, Jack had a katu- a katu could he? An acoustic guitar with him on stage. He could have done something off of Floors. It's one of my, they're all kind of my favorite album, but nonetheless, I love that album. And despite it being acoustic, you could have done it, but they never do. I mean, oh well, apart from that. The, the only other thing that really irked me is that um, your eyes got ditched. I've seen your eyes with the previous three times I've seen them. It's they played it every time and it's brilliant live. So it's Home By Now. I usually don't like Home By Now, but live, I think it's brilliant. And they ditched that too. It was actually quite a short show, it was only about an hour and 10 minutes. I guess they were ditched so they could play two new songs. The first one, the one that they released, My Big Day. Mm. I mean, it is important that each album is uniquely different from your previous and that you don't just make another cardboard cutout. It's an okay song, it will take me a while to get used to it. But they also sang another song that which they haven't released, which is going to be on their new album called Diving. And I really like that song. I filmed some of it, I'm definitely looking forward to editing this so I can watch over that clip again and again and again. Because it is all I'm going to be able to remember of the song. <laughs> Finally, uh, big shout out to the lead singer, Jack Steadman, for pointing out my shirt. I was right at the front, I got there earlier and the place was so small that I could easily get a spot at the front. And I was the only person wearing this t-shirt. I looked around, I think I was the only person wearing Bombay merch. And Jack pointed it out and pointed out that this was like the fundraiser for the series of lockdowns we went through in the UK. Uh, I got very, very excited. Anyway, onto the footage of the concert itself. Bye. 
says it's going to be the end. You are the Can I wake you up? Can I wake you up? Is it late enough? Is it late enough? There's a story in which my eyes are. Would you back me up? Would you back me up? Would you back me up? There's a lot of words to call Like this, like this, like this